I deserve better, you say, but you keep your eyes to your feet while you say it because you're not sure that you believe it. You don't feel like the best version of yourself right now. And maybe this quarter-hearted, selfish, not quite love is the best that you can get. Maybe you should apologize. Backstep into this relationship that always kept the side door open. Maybe you should stay with them. The one that always gives you so many reasons to hope that they love you. But I think you are starting to realize that you are not half a person. Love should not be a phantom limb. Something that you feel is there, but never really is. I think you are starting to know that you need to take care of yourself. And self-care is not always yoga and hot baths. Sometimes self-care is finally shutting the door on someone. Someone who never wipes their feet when they decide it is time to walk back into your life. If you have to pry love from someone's hands, you should save your strength. Let them keep the warmth that they are not willing to share with you. They might need it. It is rarer than we think that we hurt each other on purpose. But you deserve more than the aftermath of someone else's insecurity. If you have to ask, what are we? The answer is probably nothing. And that might sound like tough love, but to love yourself, you need to be tough. No, you are not where you want to be in life right now. But clinging on to this deadweight possibility of love is only slowing down your journey. You are always giving out gifts and assuming that the thank you notes got lost in the post. You always see the best in people, even when they don't deserve it. And the world needs people like you. Forgiveness and trust are becoming dead languages, which you are still fluent in. And usually that is a blessing, but right now it is a curse. But unlike a fairy tale, the only thing that will be broken with a kiss is your heart. So speak up. Raise your eyes along with your standards. No, the goodbye speech will not go as well as it did in your head. You will stumble over words and hot tears will pour down your face. But it is okay if your voice cracks and your forehead sweats. It is okay that you still have a long way to go. Remember, you are not a plan B or an afterthought. So say it to their face and then quietly to yourself. I deserve better. <laughs>